Hey guys, welcome to another Geek Tech video where we make tech tutorials and gaming simpler and better. Today we're taking a look at the latest update to Microsoft PC Manager, which now offers a deep uninstaller feature. Let's see if it's really a game changer or if we still need third party apps like Revo Uninstaller and its Pro version. So I can already hear a lot of you asking, what is Microsoft PC Manager? Microsoft PC Manager is an official app that helps optimize your Windows PC, cleaning junk files, memory, managing startup items, and now deep uninstall programs, apparently. It's meant to be an all-in-one tool, so you don't have to rely on third-party solutions for basic maintenance, I guess. The deep uninstaller is the big headline of this update. You can remove installed software without searching for extra leftover files. Among its pros, at least that it's built right into PC Manager, so you don't have to download anything extra, but you do have to enable it through its options. The interface is simple. Just select a program and uninstall through the apps menu. Limitations, uh, here's the catch. It doesn't show exactly what it's removing. No list of leftover registry entries or orphaned folders or even files that it might leave behind. So if you're a power user who wants to confirm each file that gets nuked, you're out of luck because basically, if for example, you want to uninstall a game and you use the deep uninstaller feature, you're not sure what it actually did in your registry, but I think it's more important that you're not sure what files it left behind and what files it actually deleted because you might want to replay this game, but you're running out of space, for example. And now once you do the deep uninstall, you're not sure if this feature actually deleted your save files in your settings. And now you have to replay the whole game from the beginning because, you know, it might not be a Steam Cloud enabled game. So you might have to do everything all over again from the beginning. We do have a very good third party tool to compare to, though, which is Revo Uninstaller. And it has taken the place of CCleaner, which actually, after many, many years, became a, kind of a bloatware software. But yeah, Revon Installer and its Pro version are actually the king of kings when it comes to deep uninstallers. And I think that one of its big pros is its transparency. So Revon Installer scans your system after the normal uninstaller of each application, showing you every leftover registry and folder and file. You can pick and choose what to delete. And um, basically it hands you a blueprint of everything it's going to remove and what it is going to do. Microsoft 2 by contrast is more of a black box in my opinion. For ease of use, like if you're new to advanced installers and you're not very tech savvy, Microsoft Solution is a quick fix, but if you like seeing every nook and cranny, Revo still wins for transparency alone, in my opinion, let alone the other extra granularity it offers through its options. So you can pick and choose what you're going to completely remove and what you're going to keep. Like the example we used above, we can just unselect your save file folder and your settings file folder and you will keep those files you don't have to replay the whole game you don't have to redo your settings um, from the beginning so is microsoft's pc managers deep uninstaller a revo uninstaller killer not quite it's definitely convenient for everyday users or first-time users of these features but it lacks that deeper insight uh, revo gives if you just want a simple uninstall and you're good to go, I guess, with Microsoft's tool. If you want full control over every file and you want to know exactly what's happening on your system, uh, Revo is still your best bet. So thank you so much for watching, guys. Hit like, subscribe, click on that bell if you never want to miss another of my videos and drop your thoughts in the comments below. You know, we're we apparently do everything. You can find Microsoft's tool in Microsoft Store. And uh, yeah, I'll have a link in the description.
below. Everything just goes down there. I don't know, guys. It's a magical place. Also, don't forget to follow me in these other beautiful social media because soon enough I'm planning on a live stream and we're probably going to be live streaming on uh, YouTube and Twitch. Not sure if I'm going to be streaming in those other platforms as well, but stay tuned and I'm going to update you all. So yeah, until next time, bye-bye, bye, bye. -bye. bye, -bye.